Welcome to an incredible Daily Smash for Wednesday, May 10th, 2023. I'm Rick. I'm Kelly. Today has been an incredible day. Oh my God. Awesome. Amazing. So gratifying. Um, we have two amazing stories to share with you. Uh, our patron, Lise, got every single thing on her baby registry in one day after we talked about it on this show. And we want to tell you more about that. And also, we got a unanimous vote to approve our pickleball court permit in Palm Desert with eight conditions <laughs> that we will tell you about. But you gotta, you guys got to hear the neighbor it's story. A crazy You've story. got to hear the neighbor story. So please stay <laughs> tuned. You're going to die. First yeah. uh, and foremost, thank you, Ilya, for sponsoring the Daily Smash. This is a terrific wine. We want you to try it. We promise you're going to love it. And you can get it at Ilya.com and use the discount code Rick and Kelly ten for ten percent off at Ilya.com for Ilya wine. Plenty of varieties. Something for everybody, and it's awesome. It's How awesome. great is that it's wine? It's delicious. It's amazing. It's sexy. It's fruity. It's good. It's mm, it's delicious. Tell it's- the story about how this all came up with Lise. Okay, so Lise has been a patron of ours for a couple of years, and we have party patrons. And every Sunday, we or sun, whatever day we can do it, we have to do that. We do a done. Zoom call. We do a Zoom call, and it's a party, and we get to know each other each week, and. Over the couple of years since I got fired, um, I've had the most incredible, supportive people that have supported me after getting fired. And yeah. and she's one of them. And she's one of them. And so so every single week, Lisa is on the call. So, you know, we see her daughter all the time. She's got another couple of kids that are a little bit older. But, you know, she's, you know, we all kind of know like what goes on in each and one of our lives. And um, she never really said anything bad about her husband all that much, but we kind of knew there were some problems there. So she finds out she's pregnant and um, she tells us she's like pregnant and she wasn't showing at all. And this has been a couple of years. Yeah. And and she didn't really ever complain about him until things went south. Right. I mean, she maybe a little bit here or there. So, but, oops, oh my oops. God. Um, let me just grab that with my toe. I just grabbed that with my toe. I'm so sorry. It's okay. It's working. Should we do you know what? There's mi- again? No, there's mishaps. It's okay. People understand. They like it when it's raw. I'm just going to, okay. Okay. We're not, we all can't be professional, Rick Leventhal. <laughs> so, it, so long story short, she calls, we see her and she's like hysterically crying and says that her husband kicked her out on the streets and put a restraining order on her, blah, 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 blah. And she didn't have anywhere to go, but somebody from her church let her stay in their house that was supposed to be an Airbnb, and um, she couldn't Airbnb it out. So the woman from church is letting Lee stay. She got custody back of her kids. Her parents are helping out. They live in Florida. She lives in North Carolina. And was it North Carolina, not South Carolina? Yeah, she lives in North Carolina. So I've been concerned about... Lease and so my friend Kylie, she's also been become friends with her via Zoom, and they both live in North Carolina. And you know, Kylie is just such a warm, generous person. She's like, I will do anything to help or whatever. So we're all in the and I haven't seen Lisa in a while. I'm like, please give us an update of what's going on. And she's like, my the girl from church is letting her stay at the house, and he is. She's like, I don't have anything for the kids or whatever. She was worried. worried. She's, seven, she's seven weeks away from giving birth, and she was concerned about how she's going to take care of this kid. With, you know, with she's zero not, money. Not right? at home, or you know, she's split up from the husband. And So another so, patron came up with the idea, well, why don't we help her out with a baby registry? Why don't you go on Amazon and create a baby registry, and, and we'll help you out. Right, and that's exactly what I did. And I go, you know what? And I will post this on YouTube on my with, to share it with my smashers. Yeah. So, and by the way, there was like 20 people on this Zoom call and we were all crying. Yeah, it okay? was really emotional. It was really really emotional for all of us. So, um we put it on our our thing. I wake up this the morning, smash yesterday. the smash. I wake up this morning and um this woman, if you can read the comments, she's from Dubai. She's like I can take care of most of everything. I don't know. I have not I've been out you guys with this pickleball stuff, so I haven't really seeing what happened so lease um i'm gonna cry right well, now. i have the registry right here 
Yeah, okay, uh, go ahead. But I want to read what Lise wrote me this morning. Oh, go ahead. So um, Lise this morning texts me at when we're on our way to um, our, our hearing. She says, hi, Kelly. Hi, Rick. I'm sure you're not surprised, but I wanted to share the amazing news about the support and generosity your community has shown me today. The whole registry has been purchased and then some. I'm in awe by how quickly God heard and answered my private prayers, expressing how unprepared I felt to receive baby Eden. This is the most incredible and humbling blessing to experience, especially right before Mother's Day. All the provisions for this little angel give me the chance to breathe again and rejoice in an absolute miracle. Your community is a beautiful reflection of love and support and how you two radiate for each other and your followers. Thank you for believing in me and helping me overcome a major obstacle in this crazy situation. I've never expected that this would be a part of my story, but you guys have given me a gift of a lifetime. I look forward to the days when God will grant me the ability to pay it forward. Many blessings to you both today and always with mucho love and gratitude. Lise, Kelly, Lucas, Amara, and baby Eden. So sweet. It was so sweet. I mean, it's so sweet. So so, so one of our patrons. So can I just one play our- this um, uh, message from Kylie? I get this just now. Hey, Kelly, it's Kylie. I just wanted to call you uh, briefly, voice text, and let you know that um, you were well, you and Rick are one of the most special set of people that I've ever met. Um, Elise uh, called me after I texted her. I said, hey, you know, you should look at your Amazon. I guess she was at the library or something like that. And she called me back and she said, Kylie, everything is bought. She goes, oh, my God. She goes, everything is bought. The amount and the excitement in her voice. I wish that I could make my brain a recording because just to, just to hear that, just it was beautiful. I, I mean, I, it's something I will never forget in my entire life. And just the way that you guys brought it together and the gift that you gave to somebody who was in need. I, I cannot tell you how much. Oh, I just can't tell you. It's a miracle. This is the scroll of all of the gifts that were purchased by our smashers, by you guys. Maybe one of you, but maybe other. I think others contributed too. And when I went on there, there was $240 left in the diaper fund. So I, Kelly and I took care of that $240. You so. guys are amazing, amazing people. And I just want to thank you so much. Um, you guys are really, really special and just makes me want to like break down and cry. So thank you. Thank you so much for your generosity and helping somebody that was in need. It's just yeah, really, it, really, really I mean, nice. it, you know, when you can use a show like this for good, it's... it's it is. It's really, really nice. So and, and thank Lise, you. And Lise is beyond, you. she is beyond words. She's, she's really so emotional thankful. and grateful. And thankful and grateful. She's yeah. a really warm, generous. So thank you. Thank you guys. And thank you for supporting us and... It's just a really, really, I'm just, you know, I'm just so happy and I feel so good about this. And me too. And, 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 you know, it gives her great comfort now. She going forward, she doesn't have to worry about her diapers for a year. She doesn't have to worry about the formula or the, all the little baby things that she didn't have. So great. So that happened. So, so we, <laughs> well, she really had great. them, we're, but the husband took them and we yeah. all know, okay. Us women, how much of jerks of husbands can be. And we all have experienced that. So um, you guys can relate. Well, you got a good one now. <laughs> yes. Thank you.